In the California Railroad Museum Sacramento facility, the new custom-built $600,000 boiler has arrived. It sits beside its 120-year-old predecessor. Aside from welds, instead of rivets, it's an exact duplicate. The long boiler has a firebox at the rear where coal or oil is burned and heats up water taken from the tender. The boiler is kept nearly full at all times. The steam builds pressure just like a tea kettle and that is gathered in the steam dome. Inside the dome is a valve controlled by the engineer. When he opens it, the high pressure steam is let into a big pipe running to the front of the engine where it's separated and taken down to each cylinder. A valve slides back and forth across the top of the cylinder, letting high pressure steam in to push the piston one way an opening on the other side when the piston moves back, letting the steam out. Each stroke of the piston pushes the rods which turn the wheels. The escaping steam and smoke on each side of the stroke of the piston create the chugging sound we all know. 